Amid all the talk of Eden Hazard's form this season, there's another player busy impressing a new Chelsea manager, Maurizio Sarri. William looked to be on his way out over the summer, but after a good World Cup for Brazil, he's played in every Premier League game so far. I've come to meet him to reflect on the past five years at the club and ask what the future holds. In the summer, you were linked to Barcelona and United and all these great big clubs, um, but you stayed here. It seems like you're happy and that you didn't want to go anywhere else. I love to live here. My family love to live in London. I love to play for Chelsea. Everything is amazing. I'm here already five years and I hope to stay more, a couple of years, so everything is, is perfect. You came from the Ukraine to England and you've got twin girls, beautiful little girls, and they were barely walking. Now they're six. It's been a long time here. Does it feel like home now? Yes, yes, of course. My family don't want to leave. <laughs> <laughs> the wife's opinion is important. She likes London, she likes London. She's the boss. <laughs> <laughs> you played Manchester United at the weekend. Um, it was an intense game and then it got very heated at the end, emotions running high. What was it like for the players? We, we, we like to play games like, like these games, you know. We want to feel the, the pressure, we want to feel the atmosphere. Yeah, I think it was good because uh, we get one point. Sometimes it's better one than nothing. And uh, we're still there. William's relationship with the previous manager here at Stamford Bridge was subject of much speculation. So what has changed under the new regime? William certainly looks like a, a good fit uh, for Sarri to me. And you can see that in his early performances. It's interesting because straight away you thought there's going to be some sort of competition between him and Pedro to start uh, as part of that three-man attack. You think Eden Hazard's almost certainly going to start. And so far, early days, but it looks like Willian has, has had slightly more of that. Both of them clearly uh, are capable of being very quick players, very direct players. I think the difference between Willian and, and Pedro is that where Pedro has that ability to surge on and get into the box a little bit more, get in the end of crosses. William's really good in tight spaces. And I think that's something that um, Sarri appreciates in a footballer, is, is technical ability. How important was Sarri's arrival for you in particular? Uh, it was very important, not only for me, but for all the team. We like the way he works. We like because now we play football, you know. He wants us to play football, he wants us he wants us to have fun inside the pitch. We, we play a proper football and uh, every, players, every single player is happy to, to work with him. Well, William's background is a classical story of a, of a Brazilian player who comes from the, the, you know, the working classes and uses sport to basically make, make a living. William is viewed as this player with a lot of potential for club, but for country people still think that he should have done a bit better, which is a shame because it's a bit unfair as well in my, in my humble opinion. But whoever watches the Premier League, sees what he's been doing for Chelsea, really kind of like admires his style, admires his finesse, his skills. I'm not surprised that he's performing well because he, if, if you know how to deploy him, if you give him space to do what he wants and, and, and do what he can, you, you, you get the best of him. So what does William bring to this Chelsea team? We've asked another winger famous in these parts for his analysis. One of the problems of having a player of the standard of Eden Hazard in your side is it tends to overshadow everybody else. Since he came to the club in 2012, he's had the left-hand side of the attack all sorted. And that's only left one position available on the right-hand side of attack if you're an attack-minded player at Chelsea. But the one player above everyone else who's managed to come closer to making it his own is Willian. The ball skills are an absolute given. And for goodness sake, he's an attacking right-sided player, first choice for the Brazilian national side. His work rate also for the national side is incredible. And uh, there's another player that could maybe learn a little bit for that. 
and that's Neymar. One of the other great skills, of course, that Willian has got is his free kicks. They are exceptional. I mean, he scores a lot of his goals from outside the box anyway in open play, but the free kicks, he's gone through periods where he just slows them in and the goalkeeper can do nothing at the back post. So what's not to like about Willian? He works hard. He's incredibly talented. He's got an absolutely perfect attitude as well. The other one thing I don't like is his hair, but that's only because I'm jealous. Tell us about playing in the front three. How do you work together? Yeah, we work very well. We know the movements, we know everything. Of course, in football, always you have to improve. And uh, we, we're trying to do that. But we feel very good. I think we play as a team. I think uh, for me, I have to think about, not about me, about the team, not to help the team. If I don't score, but if other players they score, the most important is to win. This season, what do you think Chelsea can achieve? We are just in the, the beginning. We have a new manager. We know we have to learn more from him. But uh, I think we can do great things this season. You're 30 now? I'm old, old boy. You're not old, there's nothing wrong with being 30. But what does the future hold for you? What, would you? what is left for you to achieve? I'm 30, but I feel, I feel young. I feel <laughs> I'm uh, maybe 24, 25, and uh, the future is that. I want to, to win more titles. Well, you look young, so that's, that's fine. Yes, yeah, it's good, no? <laughs> <laughs> William, thank you so much. Thank you, it was my pleasure. Obrigado.